what was I saying? Oh, but like I would love to rob a bank. I just want not because I like, want to kill or hurt people. I just think it would be so much fun to like go in and be like, put the money in the bag. Like, don't look at me. Get your eyes on the floor. Are you, like, a you know, psycho? Just, like, kick under there. I mean, dude, don't you think that would be fun? Like, I would love, like, a no. like basically, like, an escape room, but just a simulation where you could, like, pretend to rob a bank. I would f love that. If I ever made, like, millions of dollars, like, I would hire, like, people, and I would build, like, a small, like, fake bank, like, in my backyard, and I would just, like, rob it, like, every other day. Oh, that would be amazing. We have returned. To this powerful, powerful human. He's too powerful. Not even human anymore. Wait, we do need to take the helmet off. I think if the helmet's off, it's less powerful, like, immediately. Well, that looks dumb. <laughs> that looks <laughs> it looks like a droid from Star Wars. Yeah. Like, the eye holes in that would not be where his actual head is. Oh, now you're just, like, a dirty, filthy boy. We gotta see his face. Oh, fuck. Now we're a furry. <laughs> I think we got it. We have to undo this. We do have to undo this. So, what? We're just gonna go back to our magic great swords? I mean, what do you think? Um... I mean, it, what it really comes down to is, like, how easy you want the rest of the bosses in the game to be. I did warn you, though, before that, like, sh Melania is, like, pretty much the toughest boss in the game. And so you kind of melted her pretty easily. So like, pot, pot is too powerful right now. The other bosses in the game, you'll be able to eat, beat very We, we have... I am making an executive decision. We've become too strong. All right. We're going back to Edge Lord Magic Great Sword Pot, which is still very strong, but not as strong. And we we will revisit this pot should the need arise. Oh, I see. So this is like your your yeah, alter yeah, yeah. ego. This, this is, is like dark Super side. Saiyan Pot. Like we bust him out whenever we have to. Yeah. All right, that's fair. We probably don't need the ice stuff on our equip bar anymore. No, we gotta fix all this. <laughs> Maybe we, oh, that, that other stuff's fine. The crab and the, we just need to put our uh, thing back. We need to put. Let's the put the crab in our inventory so that yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Because we're gonna keep using the crab. the crab. Like if Jesse, if I didn't have the crab on there for you to fucking harp about, <laughs> I had a whole bunch of these little. I gave this so to many you in case you would have got. I gave this to you in case you caught the scarlet rot in the fight. Oh, totally forgot about that. We never caught the scarlet rot. All right, is everything good now? Everything's good. Are we back like to we normal? talked about last time. We're gonna look for Mikola. Oh, I got a. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad I did that now. Out. That would have been funny. You're like I can't dodge. I'm just too too busy doing the star caller cry. I don't know if I've ever called that move by its actual name. <laughs> this entire time, I always say something different. All right. The star scream. Yeah, I kind of miss right. not like jumping around. I feel so slow so, yeah, now. We, yeah, we did this area. We completed it. Where is he, that little bitch? Nicola. So he got absconded. Um. Stop using big so, words. You fucking I just really nerd. like the word absconded. So he is on this map somewhere. The way to get to him. Um, in, in the snowy area. In the snowy oh. area. There is a portal down by it's hard to tell do you see how okay you keep fucking like zooming up try, to the left to the left of the snow area yeah like over here for fuck's sake you can't go there yeah like, all right so that's a mine there but we don't want the mine it's like up a bit i think like against the wall on this side behind like a ruined area so just like in this territory yeah on foot, you'll be able to, I think, get a better idea. Yeah, probably. Also, I do have a request for you. Uh-huh. There's an NPC invader that refuses to invade me, and they drop their armor set, and I want you to get it for me and give it to me. Why don't they? Where is it? It's, it's like literally right in front of where we need to be. 
that's I didn't know about this until like I went through and checked to see if I got all the armor in the game, and there's like this one I didn't get, and it's because the fucking NPC won't evade me. Uh, yeah, so go towards these like big tree things. What's that little eerie music? No, I think the NPC would invade you like somewhere around here. Someone's fucking singing. It's one of those um. Oh, like, those you know, those dumb the... people. Yeah, choose these guys. Remember these like little lightning things. Careful, they're behind you. I'll get invaded somewhere around here. No, it's more to the left, actually. There is the mine here that you can go down, but I don't know if we need to do that. I think oh, we shit. have enough upgraded weapons. Yeah. All right, so this is the rune I was talking about. Oh, it's on the other side of this rune. You see where the trees are on the other side of the rune? Big man. Yeah, this area is kind of annoying. There's a lot of these big fucking Cthulhu monsters. That sounds like they took the fucking clip from Berserker from Fate's Day Night. <laughs> yeah, he should invade you somewhere in this like little forest area here. And if it doesn't happen for you, I just whatever. Give up at that point. Oh, it's happening. Beautiful. Where is it? So we haven't learned a lot about the Lord of Blood. Um, Sanguine <clears throat> Noble. So it's a bloody fucker. Do you remember White-Faced Vare that like told you that you were maidenless at the beginning? Yeah, that cunt. If we would have found... Oh, there he is. If you would have found him um, in the world further, he would have like told you he Whoa. was like big into the Lord of Blood. And like he would have given you an item to like invade other people and stuff, and that's how we would have been able to go to the Lord of Blood sooner. That fucking than we oh my god! Oh, is this the fucking guy that from the beginning with the little dagger that fucked us? He's fucking me now. Remember when we got the help of the? Like, I mean, samurai? yeah, he's got the same little daggers. Remember, use your star caller cry. Your star oh, I cry. forgot I even had that. <laughs> it's just What's a with GPS this fucking bug? Easy. I want that outfit. <laughs> Next time we're off camera, you gotta drop it for me. Are you Got gonna like put it on? Fancy hood. Oh, you do have a new fancy hood. I can't really tell. Is it good? Does it match? It's okay. I don't think it's as good as the other one, but it's a little bit more fancy. I think we use it, honestly. You're sick of this hood? I mean, it's just like it, it it's the like little gold embroidery like matches, matches your sword. the swords. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Oh, Jesse, what makes you think you're ever gonna get that from me? I want that. Alright, and so the uh we're looking for a portal. It's behind these ruins, like near the street. You're gonna to the right. have to earn it just like that sword you want. <laughs> I would rather have the, the, the clothes than the sword. Because I can always grind out the sword. I can't get those clothes. You just have to I play another game. Bus. Yeah. Alright, I think we went... It, it, I think it's behind us now. Behind us? It's somewhere along this cliff. Yeah, maybe back there. Back here or back the other way? No, 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 the other way. Like, yeah, I see at the... And fuck this guy. Dude, what does he think he's doing? This is like super easy to miss. Cause if, so if you talk to Vare, you can go to this location earlier than we are able to get there. But um, it's like fine. Back over there? The yeah, yeah, see the edge of the cliff there? Like up yeah, ground or the low ground? No, low ground. Oh, okay. I think we're just looking for those like little toad people and they're like around a portal. No, it might be the other way then. On the other side of the ruin, maybe. Well, we just gotta explore all the edges. 
right, and why are we coming here? These are the people that stole that little bitch that I'm coming after. Yeah, we're looking for Mikela, and he has been taken by the person. I, I think still it's the don't last I don't understand why his sister didn't fucking go to help him. I guess she. Yeah, oh, there's a toad down there. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, that's where we want to go. Right here. That's a good question, honestly. Like, if we could have figured this out, like she could have probably. There should be like one of those little portals. Yep, yep, there it is. And there's like a bunch of fucking like shark loot coming out of it. All right. Now I don't know how well you remember, but in um, Nocron, we could mm -hmm. see this location. We were just never able to get there. You, I think you so probably now. brought it up, as you always say things like, "Hey, look at that! You can't get there." <laughs> And I'm sure my response was like, whatever. The Mogwin Palace. You can use your horse here too, I believe. They're fucking crazy. <clears throat> oh, there's one down there. So this grace here that we're about to get is this is everybody's favorite farming spot in the game. Right. You'll see once we get down to the grace. There's a bunch of those like little toad people, and they give you tons of souls. Look up though, like look up that yeah, that that's our goal. We want to get up there. Sounds good. Pick some herbs. So this is like the land of blood. I mean, Do you I, remember? What... Oh, good. It's not something I would pick. Like yeah. where to live. Do you remember when we talked to that like old cunt with oh, the, these uh, guys? The ears. Yeah, these little toad guys. They give you tons of souls. You just farm this area. Wow. That was yeah, a like lot, relatively soldiers. quickly. Yep. Oh, they can fucking roly poly move. The red, the red ones are dangerous. No one is dangerous. Yeah, so if we ever need to become more powerful than we were before, this is an easy area to get souls. But if we would have talked to that old... We did talk to the old kind. Remember, he was like, hey, I'm looking for the, the last couple uh, demigods. And he said Melania, he said Rani. And the said, Lord of Blood. Yes, and that was the last one, was the Lord of Blood. I Nicola need to kill... And, and if remember, my mission right now is to kill all of them, because that will give me a chance to kill him, you said. Yes. I think at some point next time we find another set of grace, we do want to go back to the round table hold and talk to him again, maybe just to let him like update him. Because I will kill him, Jesse. Oh, why can't I, I ride my horse? You're getting anymore? invaded. You're getting invaded by Vare. Who? Who's that? The the maidenless guy from the beginning. Oh wow, he's fucking. He really wants some of this after all this time. You don't even get the star caller cry. Oh fuck. Maybe I shouldn't have been so like. No. Nah. You haven't even earned my most powerful attack, you little bitch. <laughs> he will keep invading you, just so you know. Oh. Until we get like past this area. Like he, he invades you a couple more times while we're here. That dumb bird. Like this blood bubbles coming at me. Like, imagine what this place would smell like. Bloody. Like, the smell of blood. Ugh. Does it bother you that much? I mean, it's just a very, like, intense smell. It's, like, very minerally and kind of, like, rich, almost. Actually, if way. it went, like, stagnant, I bet it would be, like, really fucking gross, huh? Yeah. Oh, there's a golden seed up there. I don't know if we still need those, but... Where? Oh, up right. there. I mean, why not? Oh, fucking oh, Gen. Dude. Those annoying dogs are coming for you. And these dogs can one-hit kill you. Just be careful. What? They have, like, a move. Yeah, they have, like... It's, like, this bullshit move where they will kill you in, like, one hit. 
I don't know how they do it, but. I'm not saying every hit that they get on you. Yeah, will be yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that bleed. I didn't really think this through. Oh, he sent like bugs after you. Man, fucking he dogs. He's making you bleed. Oh, I I wasn't really giving you directions in, but the way you were going there was not like the critical pathway. That's just like a little extra area. Oh, that's fucking. We need to go the critical path. I mean, do we even need our souls? Like, how much do you think you're gonna level up? It was 50,000 souls, but I'm not worried about it. Because it was all from those little frog boys right there. So if I truly wanted to level up, I could just get them there again. I like how you were going to ride towards the item, and then you're like, Nah, I can't fucking be bothered to, like, readjust where I'm riding. It probably that wasn't was anything more. worth it. Like, there are very few items that I would even want at this point. You are going the right way now. We just need to get through the Lake of Blood. No, this is not the right way anymore. Dude, these fucking guys. They're little pinwheels. Alright, there's some big one of those frogs here, and they'll summon giant skeletons. Oh, that's neat. The giant skeletons shoot laser beams, too. <laughs> this area is bullshit. Ah! All right, there's a site of grace right in this little temple. Beautiful. Oh man, I forgot how much we missed the fucking oboe music. <laughs> Threatening oboe. Oh, there's a little thing there. All right. Now it's not hard to like um get to the boss from there. We just pretty much... There's not, like, a lot of, like, other ways we can go other than the critical path, so I'll just let you kind of... Run past all these goons. Pardon me. <laughs> just like your average day. Average day at the farmer's market. Mm-hmm. Ooh. That's gross. Like... I'm stuck. That I'm looks stuck. like that looks like something. Have you ever watched like Doctor Pimple Popper? Like that looks no. like something that would come out of somebody's neck. What's this? I don't know that sh that show makes me ill. But like for some reason, like especially like women in like the medical health field are like obsessed with like watching people like get their fucking gross shit pop. I don't understand it. Like these guys it's are like praying. They love this bloody man. It's like the fucking millennial female version of, like, you know how they're all into, like, true crime? Like, they also are all big into, like, pimple popping. It's very dark in here. Yeah, spooky. There's a man invading you. Behind. I have to fight him? I don't know. Oh, this is very running. spooky. I don't like this. Why? You, if you like to see their silhouette. Yeah, that makes it even spookier. I think I was worth 6,000 souls. I don't know if we've done enough um, of the Ivaris quest, but you can actually invade him. Like, and kill head, him? When you find his summoning sign. Yeah, and kill him for real, for real. Yeah, it's like up here, at least, whenever I did it. Maybe not for you, though. Like what, out yeah, here? Yeah, it's like behind you. No, it was like in that hallway that you just ran through. Oh. I think that's where it was for me. I guess not. You haven't done his quest no. far enough. They don't want me to kill him yet. Not like I did yeah, patches. Yeah, don't worry about it. Man, that's a fucking bummer that you killed Patches. I don't regret it even slightly. Oh man, I want to do a Starcaller cry here with all those fucking dudes. 
Come to me. All these bitches. Who's this bitch? Oh, oh dude, like... that's instant 20,000 soul. <laughs> yeah, oh, ski ski, motherfucker. Oh, ski ski, Ugh. goddamn. He has a treasure chest up there. Fucking blood makes me slow. Nice. In case you want to upgrade your uh, great serpent hunting spear all the way. Yeah, right? You know how much I love that. All right. Are you ready for... Oh, yeah. We, we said we were going to go to back to the round table hold. We should do that before we forget. Oh, yeah. You know how much I was looking forward to that. We still haven't learned how to quickly do it. We have to scroll all the way over to it every time we open the map. <laughs> it's not like it happens that frequently to be worth knowing. I mean, maybe if it's, you're the one. Like, you still have all your fucking NPCs here. In my game... In my game, I fucking everybody's dead or gone. What's this? Oh, I can get stuff. Is it anything worth it? I don't remember. What does she stop talking? I want to see your loot. Show me your fucking loot, woman. Is this the right one? Oh, wow. Yeah, I mean, that's tons of different armor that we could buy. I get that guy's armor. get all this dumb stuff with the wig. What is that? That was uh, Loretta. Remember how I told you that she uh, had cool armor, like when she was on her horse. But when you wear that armor, it looks so fucking dumb. We could buy. You know what would be worth it? Maybe what? Depending if we ever want to become big heavy pot again, is uh, the pirate's armor. The pirate had big heavy armor. The electric pirate. This stuff. Yeah, that one. The veteran's gear. No, no, it's called the veteran's gear. Over. Yeah, that one. Oh, baby. That is... Look at that poise. 37? Yeah, it's big boy armor. Yep. And you can see your head in that one, too. You can see your face. Yo, stop being a creep. <laughs> You don't want to get Melania's katana. I would have if I if it was like attached to the glove because that's pretty cool. Yeah, but it's a dex weapon. Oh yeah, so we want to update this guy. Come on. What's up, you fucking asshole? Uh, pretty much. Yeah. Uh, no, she's dead as shit. So just tell them about the Halig tree roots and using the secret medallion. Like, just do all the dialogue. So just... I heard speculation Nicola embedded, but indeed, how vexing. Perhaps the queen sorrow was. Ah. Yeah, you're fucking, you don't know shit. The information you shared is a great secret. You are a true fellow. You are a true fellow. I'm going to kill him. Yeah, dude, fuck this guy. I don't understand how he doesn't figure that he's gonna get fucking wrecked by me. Ah, uh, yeah, tell him about You are a true fellow. And then this is just the, like, remember the weird quest yeah. where the guy wanted you to... Oh, it's poison. the same fucking shit. Yeah, that's it. We, we did everything we needed. What's up, bitches? Who else we got in here? These guys. Have uh, we even talked to the Loathsome Dung Eater at all? Ah, uh, yeah, I think we talked to him once. No. You have felt fucking smelly though. Apparently not. Was it oh, you picked up one of his things. We've never gone in the sewer, and I don't think we Whoa! are going to at this point. Why is he fucking coming at me like that? He's a fucking asshole. That's his thing, is he likes killing people and defiling their corpses. Okay, can I fight him? You can, if you, like, do his thing. I would like to kill him, because he did kind of threaten me. The thing is, when you kill him... So, you go to... Oh, he's dead! Oh. <laughs> he finally died. Nice, we got his little wizard outfit. 
Roger. The fancy wizard boy. Man, remember how much he helped you at the beginning of the game? Uh huh. What an absolute lad. Oh, she's still here. We can still give her a hug. Not happening. All right. All right. What was I even saying though? Oh, if you wanted to do um. I like how I don't have the above. Quest. Where is it? It's the on the right, the Mogwin Palace. Nope. Yes. Nope. No, this one? No, the one you were just on. This one. Yes. I was on that one and you said no. Well, it was like a delayed no. Like, I don't know. Maybe your stream is like a little slow by a second. It's <laughs> this. Fuck you. Let's go. I mean, you know, anytime you need 20,000 souls, you can just go here and just fucking suck them all in. Mm -hmm. What was I saying, though? Oh, fuckface. So if you wanted to do his thing, so what you do is you go down the sewer. He's not that far, and in the sewer, he's kind of easy to get to. And then he's in, like, a little jail cell, and then you can free him. Then he'll invade you in the above ground once you kill him in his evade to his, like, little jail oh. cell, and he's all tied up in a chair. Man, and then that you one... can force feed him, like, come. Fucking weird. That elevator didn't give you much time to get off of it. This is a pretty cool cutscene. Let's pay attention then. Well, we know who that is. Uh, do we? That's the little cocoon that was in the Haley tree. Oh. But he's probably, like, corrupted now. Lord of Blood's been fucking with him for some reason. So, we'll see if we can, if you can uh, give me some lore. When you see the Lord of Blood, tell me who he's related to. It's bubbling. Is he a goat man too? Yeah, he's an omen. Dearest Nicola. Dude, why'd you fucking do this to him? You must abide alone a while. I mean, I'm gonna kill you both anyway, so. Okay. So, th I didn't find this fight super hard, but, like, I was already, like, pretty OP at that point. Oh, Lord of Blood. Get him, Pot Jr. You, you could have fought this guy earlier. He, he, you, there's, like, a fight with him underneath in the sewers of the capital. Whoa. Let me add him. But obviously, he's uh, Morgoth's brother. He's like the fancier Morgoth, though. I like his style more than Morgoth, at least. Stealing children from trees? No, I'm talking about his, like, clothes. <laughs> he does have, like, a little fancy boy robe. Yeah, he's not wearing fucking, like, rags and dirt. I think Pot Jr. could beat him. On his own? Like, I... Jesse, that sounds like a joke, but I think it might not be. Unless he gets, like, more powerful. Oh, God, he's got the fucking Ring of Death on me. Oh, yeah. That hurts. But that and then it didn't affect like Pot Jr. at all. So that was the move. I don't know if you remember me telling you that there was a uh, a, a move that we can negate by getting an item that we haven't gotten yet. But like you're fucking this dude up. I don't think you even need it. Like 
If anything, that would make the fight too easy. Yeah, that was the only time he really, like, hurt me bad. We just had to let it happen. Like, you're gonna fucking first try this, guy. Wait, we have to eat the crab. It doesn't count unless you eat the crab. I shouldn't have eaten the crab, Jesse. Yeah, with a fucking NPC summon, this fight is trivial. Like, do you want to die and try to do it without your guy? No, oh, okay. Pot Jr. is an extension of me. All right. Man, that was so easy. Like, this guy wasn't super hard for me, but it took me at least, like, 15 to 20 tries. That like, guy's a fucking chump. Get out of here. Now, let me kill the other one. Let's say it's a two-for-one time, baby. Well, you can get his big fancy robe if you want it now. Ooh, that's a lot of souls. So, unfortunately, Mikola is, like, not... He's, like, comatose. He, I don't he care. You can't really kill him. This is it. He just kind of, like, lays in that egg. Are you I don't, serious? I don't, yeah, I don't think there's anything you can do. Like, you can't, like, fight him. I would... I have no shame, though. I'd kill him like that. What level are we? Oh, we're level, like, 110 already. Wow. Maybe more... Wait, wait, wait. I was going to say, maybe more endurance, just so that we can, you know, continue to wear our heavy armor. That's fine. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Like, it, I agree, it was kind of anticlimactic. Like, you find, like, the egg, and, like, there might be something you can do with it, but I don't... I don't know what it is. I, I don't think there's any way to fight him, like... Let me if you read, him. If you read deep enough into the lore, it's saying that he is, like... He, the Lord of Blood stole him because he's like obsessed for it with him for like some weird fucking creepy reason, and um, he he never communicates to the Lord of Blood, and like the Lord of Blood like it keeps trying to get him to talk to him, but he refuses to communicate. But it it hints that like maybe he's like in a dream, like within a dream, like he's Inception, like he he, he his his living body in our world is not real but like his like spirit body is like living on in like a comatose dream state like somewhere i just have to let it, him be i mean for now i don't think there's anything you can do i there might be dlc i bet if they do dlc it will be related to this somehow but i don't think there's anything you can do with Mikola right now. that sucks he's ass just kinda, he's just kind of a <laughs> you hear that miyazaki it sucks ass let me kill him all right where are we going why would you want to kill him? He's just like a child boy. I am killing boy all the egg. Elden Lords and getting their runes. That's the whole point of my existence. All right, he's not an Elden Lord. He's a he's an Empyrean and well, a Well, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm killing all the Elden people Lord. who have like the power. Oh, it doesn't let oh. you up there. <laughs> yeah, there was a wall. Yeah. So if you remember in the beginning, you probably don't, but in the first cutscene of the game, there is uh, when they're going through all the people, and I was like saying like, "Oh, that's who that is, and that's who that is." There mm -hmm. is a picture of Moog stealing like um, Mikola from the egg. Like it's like a picture of him like holding like a little greasy boy in his arms. In case you're curious. Nope. Where all are right. We so, um, do we want to go back and talk to what fuckface one more time just to make sure we like. Dust his dialogue and buy the robe and shit. I mean, you fucking tore through that so fast, Dan. Easy, man. Got it. More. We're about to do. This is like the fucking progress episode. Like we're about to do like three major bosses in the span of like a couple episodes. I'm back. Shut up. He gives you his pitchfork and like blood magic. His robe looks Honestly, cool, but what I wouldn't wear it, I don't think. It's up one. This one? Okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't Ooh. want it. It looked cool for him. Okay. Maybe just talk to Fuckface, though, like, just to finish his Yeah, dialogue. when is it about time for me to take him out the game? Man, you're very excited to kill this man. Like, when we get to that episode, like, you're going to be so happy. So I think that's it. Like he's gonna, you you will be able to kill him now. I'm pretty sure. All right, cool. All right, where is he? Yeah, we got to do some things before we do that. 
I'm not saying I'm not just saying that. Like whether like to get him to get to the part where we fight him, we need to like finish our story. Do you remember what our main mission is right we're now? We're gonna burn down the entrance to the tree. Yes, exactly. And do you remember what we were doing to get We were there? getting the giant's fire. Yes, giant's fire. So Because I'm working with that lady even though she like broke up with me. Do you see how there's that path off to the right where this there's one? the map thing we haven't got? Yeah, we wanna we want to go up to the grace that looks like it's like leading to that one. There this it one? is. Yep. So we're going to ride past like a castle and like over a chain and into like this fucking crazy area. And then, yeah. There's a big dragon on this lake, but we don't need to fight it unless you want to. Ah, it's been a while since we fought a dragon. Your old nemesis, the dragon. A little bunch of dead kids. Oh, you summon Paw Jr. here. Does Paw Jr. get a horse? <laughs> he just has to ice skate around. He Where's the dragon? Slide around. Oh, I have to fight it in like... It's somewhere. Fucking shooting at me. Oh, yep, yep. Oh, there it is. <laughs> he is hidden in the fog. That's gonna be fucking annoying as hell, isn't it? He is the freezing dragon of the fog. I mean, you just killed fucking Moog, the Lord of Blood, in, like, your first try. Like, this dragon should not be an issue. That guy was a not that hard. Again, I still think Pot Jr. could have killed him if I didn't do anything. I mean, Pod Jr. finished Melania. Yeah. I bet Pod Jr. did more damage in that fight than I did. No, there's no way. Because he's fucking throwing pots. So I guess I did more damage because of him as well. Yeah, I mean, he trivialized, like, the Moog fight for sure. You do have 50,000 souls on the ground. I don't know if that's important to you. I thought I picked him up. Nope. I thought I tried to. You can't see your map. I can't see it anymore. Oh, well. That's all right. We don't need them. I feel like they were somewhere over there. Oh, it's cleared up a bit. Yeah, where give, are you, Give souls? us the old spin. Give us a good spin here. I think they're behind. Oh, there they are. Oh, yeah, you're right. Not gonna summon Paw Jr. for this fight. Oh yeah, I forgot we could even summon him. I don't know how useful he'll be though against a dragon. Yeah, I don't think we've ever seen him fight a dragon. I don't think he can get to it fast enough. You know what I mean? No. Man, remember that time you fought that? fucking first dragon and it took us so long like a whole episode and we didn't even oh, kill it oh we're getting it. frostbite what happened Torrent died it was the like frostbite effect like on the ground oh dude pot jr getting never mind he, pot, he's, a, he's distracted by pot jr uh oh What just died? Oh, it was like a goat or jellyfish or something. Oh! The dragon cannot do enough damage to hurt Pot Jr. Mm-hmm. So it's just going to be me dying from, like, falling off Torn or getting stuck in that... Like, yeah, Ice. like this. Yep. Ah, Jesse, it's going to be too annoying with Torrent. What do you mean? Oh, you're just, like, not doing it? Like, whenever the frostbite happens, Torrent gets hurt. So I can't move, but then I fall off Torrent. But oh, I can't me, I... do anything because yeah. Torrent's on the ground and I can't I move. Understand. And I take damage when I'm knocked from that fucker. I understand that Torrent is just a load of cum. But like this fight specifically, like really highlights the the bullshit of Torrent. Yeah. So I had this thought the other day, like. 
You know how, like, everybody has, like, those little, like, doorbells, those, like, little rings that, like, have cameras on them? Mm-hmm. That must make cheating so hard now. Oh, like, probably. you can't... Yeah, you can't just, like, show up at, like, your lover's house anymore, because they might have, like, a ring, and, like, their wife will see it or whatever. So you have to, like... Or their husband or whatever, vice versa. You know? Like, that would make cheating so hard in the modern age. Like, as the years go by, like, technology has made our lives, like, fairly easier, but it has also made some things, like, completely off. Well, it, not wait, no, off. Jesse, it's made doing things that you're not meant to be doing more difficult, yes. Well, exactly. So, yeah, that's my point. Because, like, robbing banks is, like, how the fuck are you supposed to rob a bank now? But, like, back in the day, if you were, like, didn't want to go to college or, like, you had a bad up for you, you were just like, all right, I guess I'm going to be a bank robber now. But, like, you can't do that anymore. What That's time period sad. exactly are you talking about, just out of curiosity? Like, the Old West? Yeah, like, the 1800s and early 1900s. Like, you could be a bank robber if you You could really just rob a bank. To. And honestly, And either listen, you got I caught while you were doing it or you got away, and that was that. Yeah, pretty much. And you could do it multiple times, and they could never catch you. But, like... Dude, think about, like, Ned Kelly. You know who Ned Kelly is? No. He was that Australian bank robber, and literally all he did is his thing was he wore a suit of armor that he made out of, like, melted-down steel from a train track. So he he just had, like, this fucking, like, welder kind of mask, like a big metal mask, and he just wore armor, like, over his clothes. And um, he would go into banks, and he was kind of like Robin Hood. Like, he would steal money from these banks and then give it, like, to the poor Australians. But then he would ki he would always kill as many cops as he could because he hated police. So, okay. but, like, he did this. <laughs> that took a yeah, dark did... turn, didn't it? <laughs> well, there is an even darker story behind that. Like, apparently, like, his mother had been, like, falsely, like, imprisoned. And, like, just because the, like, police wanted to rape her, etc. Like, it, yeah, it's kind of fucked up. But um so yeah he loved killing cops but he did this for like a while like at least like five years maybe even 10 years and like they were like we can't do anything about this guy because if we try to shoot him he's wearing armor like, what do we do it's Man, ridiculous in america though that shit wouldn't have happened probably not we would have hit him with like a higher caliber exactly and so what they ended up doing to take him down is they shot like they figured out they could like shoot like like in between his plates on his legs and so they were like shooting his legs with like shotguns until they could bring him down eventually and then they hung so basically that man had like a fucking career though all he needed was just like some armor and a gun and like that was it you can't do that anymore yeah man the good old days when he could just get a suit of armor get a gun I mean, I know I've talked to you about this before, and, like, I'm sorry, FBI and, What is like, the CIA. fucking C Cathedral of Dragon whatever? What was that we've, message that just came up? We've never been there. There's two Cathedrals of Dragon, like, Is these, like, the cold prawns? That's a frost lobster. You couldn't frost live here. Frost lobster. You would die. Um, what was I saying? Oh, but, like, I would love to rob a bank. I just want... Not because I like, want to kill or hurt people. I just think it would be so much fun to like go in and be like, put the money in the fucking bag. Like, don't look at me. Get your eyes on the floor. Are you like, a you psycho? Know, like, under there. I mean, dude, don't <laughs> you think that would be fun? Like, I would love like a no. like basically like an escape room, but just a simulation where you could like pretend to rob a bank. I would fucking love that. If I ever made like millions of dollars, like I would hire like people and I would build like a small like fake bank like in my backyard and I would just like fucking rob it like every other day. Oh, that would be amazing. All right, we got a sacred tear. Fuck yeah. Oh, you can talk to your, your favorite wench. I need 300 more. Fuck you. Oh, we're going to do a bit of popping. Man, once you pop, you just don't stop. Oh, uh, remember all those souls that I gave? Yeah, I'm not gonna use those. Wait, did they like update this game? Yeah, why is it like telling me? Like, is it? Yeah, is yeah. It, is was this new. always like this? No, that's a hundred percent new. Is this it just because like, it realized fun. I'm a fucking idiot, or did the game update? 
I think they updated it for like idiots. Because they were wow. like, oh, I didn't know I could use my sacred tear. And yeah, talk to It's been a while, no. hasn't it? I didn't listen to that one bondage man that made me want to not or not kill you. Shall I share them with you? I'm I'm not interested, Jesse, but I know you want me to <laughs> click this one. No, I kinda wanted you to say I'm not interested. I wanna know what she would say. Like, oh, okay. Like fuck you too. <laughs> yeah, okay, thanks. Almost there, the flame of ruin. I'm glad it was you. I travel I must you. Thank you, Torrent. Man, everybody fucking goes on about Torrent. Like, Ranny and her, they're always fucking going on about how good Torrent is. Like, fuck you, Torrent. Yeah, fuck you, If Torrent. I had a fucking swimming pool filled with cum, I would throw you in it, and I wouldn't even look back. Oh, that's what I was saying earlier. If there was, like, a swamp of sadness in this game, and you could take Torrent there, and he would, like, sink... And you were supposed to be sad, like, no, oh, our tax, like, think happy thoughts, like, Torrent, no. I would just be like, I would just, like, whisper in his ear, like, the darkest shit until, like, even if you get out mud. of this, you're gonna go in the cum pool, so don't even worry about it, Torrent. <laughs> All right, this episode's then, over. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> so, like, you know how, like, and, and Atreyu's, like, sinking in the mud, too, because he's also sad. But, like, I would be fucking levitating like Jesus above the swamp of sadness because like, I'd be watching Torrent, like, sink into it. I would be so happy. Oh, fuck. Oh, I guess I have to ask you a question. Mm hmm Like, all my questions are, like, food-related lately. Like, I don't think I have any, like, better food or, like, questions. They're all, like... Give me I've your best questions. Let me have it, Jesse. Take off your limits. I know... Up to this point in this series, you've been really restrained because you didn't want to cross the line. But okay. but don't worry about it. Just say true to yourself. All right, here. Yeah, I'll ask you a real question. Then. I, it's not like a yes or no or like a this or that question. It's kind of... So I'm sure you're aware in the like enlightened age that we live in that there are like... There are entire websites dedicated to making dildos shaped like animal penises or dragon penises. Uh huh. Like, just like, how, what are your thoughts on that? Like, how do you feel about like the dragon penises? I, anytime I see the dragon penises, I think what everyone thinks, and it's like you just made that up. Like, you know what I mean? It's not like we have like in a fucking museum. They're like, and here's the dragon penis. Like, this Whoa. is what it would look like. That's not what everybody thinks, because some people think, oh, I want to stick that in me, like that weird dragon no, no, penis. No, 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 but I'm saying, like, whenever they make it, it's not shaped like a dragon penis, because we don't know what a dragon penis would be shaped like, oh, you know what I mean? They just picked okay. a thing, and that's kind of what bothers me about it. Okay, that it's not like... But, like, if you bought, like, this is, like, a fucking, like, whatever, like a real animal penis dildo, I'd think it's probably accurate. I mean, I haven't done my research, but I'm imagining someone has... Yeah, like a big old tapir dick. But like with but, dragons, okay. like why would we don't even know that a dragon would have something like that? Yeah. Why isn't it the other way though? It's always dildos for like people who are into butt stuff, like either gender. But it's never like people who want to fuck vaginas. There's not like a dragon vagina that I can like stick my dick in. You know. Oh. Like, um, you, you know, like Donkey from Shrek. Like, I want a, a, I want a dragon vagina. I'm sorry, have we talked my... about the, the, the thing about the Donkey before? <laughs> I don't think so. This this ep this is going to fucking run long, this outro. The cops is... are coming for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Get my suit of armor quick. They... Oh, no! The thing with Donkey... <laughs> Is the ultimate in my mind, like, no means no, like, fucking date rape out there? Mm -hmm. In that first movie, Donkey is very clearly, like, no. Like, oh, uh, like, yeah. He, it's not, like, I'm pretty sure he fucking says it. Like, it's out in the open. Like, he does not want this. Like, please, like, stop. <laughs> you know what I mean? But, oh, I know exactly. That's the double standard, like. It's okay if it happens to a male character, but if, like, Donkey was a female and there was a big male dragon with his big, like, his dragon dick. dildo dick, big <laughs> dragon dildo dick, and he's like, oh, I'm gonna put this in you so good, and Donkey's like, oh, please, don't. Like, yeah. you'd be like, what the fuck is going it's on? It's pretty fucked but, up. But then later, we're supposed to believe that, like, oh, now they're just happy together. And I'm like, that's no, not yeah, how that he works. Into it. 
Oh, well, she, like, yeah, I guess she, like, raped him until he was <laughs> into it. But, like, even if, it's the ultimate oh. thing of, like, even if, like, he's not into it, but then she forces it so much that then he, like, all right, whatever, and he falls yeah. into it. With modern law, like, no, that's still rape. Like, it doesn't fix it. Like, just because eventually yeah. they change their mind. Like, he wasn't into it. No means no, dragon. Thank you, Jury Marks, for not being enlightened. Like, we should... This is this is our call to cancel DreamWorks. Fucking cancel Shrek. Because it cancel always Shrek. really bothered me about yeah, the movies. Shrek. And people are like, oh, fuck, don't worry about it. But I'm always like, this is fucked up. This franchise. Indeed. All right, it's All right. time to end the episode, though. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, no.